through this true body and true blood of our Lord and our Savior Jesus Christ, strengthen and preserve you in the one true faith into life everlasting. Go now in God's peace. Amen. We stand as we sing our post communion canticle. pray. Gracious God, our Heavenly Father, you have given us a foretaste of the feast to come in the Holy Supper of your Son's body and blood. Keep us firm in the true faith throughout our days of pilgrimage that on the day of his coming we may, together with all your saints, celebrate the marriage feast of the Lamb and his kingdom which has no end. Through Jesus Christ, your Son, our Lord, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face to shine upon you and be gracious unto you. The Lord look upon you with favor and give you peace. Amen. We remain standing as we sing our closing hymn, hymn 517, by all your saints in warfare. We sing stanza one on the left hand side. Stanza six on the right hand side, and then stanza three again on the left hand side.
Good morning. It has been our pleasure to have served you in Christian worship this morning. Uh, a few things from our bulletin notes. Uh, Tuesday at 1.30 is our monthly Holy Communion service at Redbud Garden Place. Tuesday evening at 6.30 will be our Evening Guild Mother-Daughter Banquet in the Fellowship Hall. Wednesday evening is going to be our Voters' Assembly meeting, 7 o'clock in the Fellowship Hall. And Thursday at 1 o'clock, Site Ministries Center in Baldwin. We do wish you God's blessings on this day and upon your entire week as well. Thank you.